Here at Chaska High School, PBIS has really allowed us to think about behaviors and interventions differently. PBIS is a consistent terminology throughout the entire district and when kids know what the expectations are, they're able to follow it much clearer. When adults know what the expectations are, they're able to help support it and encourage it throughout each level. We are integrating these diversity lessons to focus on respect in the classroom, our pride goals, and embracing different cultures in our school. So this one specifically is going to be about a focus on microaggressions and assumptions. So first thing I want you to do, like we usually do, is respond to some questions. I did the first one, and the assumptions that I make when I meet people are the way they talk and like the words they choose. Also, I look at facial expressions and how much eye contact they make with the person that they're talking to. And I only really like um, look at clothes, whether it's like mandatory that you dress maybe more modest like at church or something like that. So instead of looking at a behavior on the negative side, we look at it on the positive side. So when a student is having uh, difficulties in school, we come together and we decide how can we intervene in a positive way. So we might put a student in a check and connect program or speak to the teachers about what they can do positively in the school or in the classroom uh, by giving Eye of the Hawk, for example. I got the Eye of the Hawk award. I just felt like really uh, appreciated by the teachers, by my hard work that I did, just putting in my assignments and everything, getting everything on time. So this year our component here at Chaska High School for our PBIS team is our Shared Voices group and it's a um, student group of diverse clubs here at our school and the impact of that um, has been amazing. So Shared Voices contributes to a, po a positive school climate because it brings everybody together so you know if Diversity Club or GSA is planning something, student council knows we can work together to contribute a welcoming, a safe environment. Respect is huge in um, shared voices because like everyone has a different experience and you can only share your own personal experience. So um, respect is huge because you need to be able to share that respect and show that respect well in the group so that everyone's opinions can be heard, everyone's um, concerns and everyone's hopes can all be shared. Well, I've had the opportunity to see PBIS implemented in two different buildings. First at a middle school level and now at a high school level. So as far as the climate, it really helps kind of develop a culture within a culture within your building that is, uh, helps everybody be successful and know what the expectations are. 